Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue. Whenever you're trying to boot into your Windows, you got the error logon.ui.exe system error. The system detected an overrun of a stack based buffer in this application. So, without wasting time, let's go ahead and proceed with the resolution. So, in order to fix out this issue, you will need a Windows 10 or Windows 11 USB drive. So, make sure you have the USB drive. Go ahead and insert the USB drive onto your PC, then restart your PC and then give boot using that USB drive. I'll go ahead and proceed with the resolution by inserting the USB drive into my PC. Select the language and over here, instead of install now, you need to choose the option repair your computer. Click on it. Click on the option troubleshoot and select command prompt over here. First of all, we are going to activate your administrator account and check if you can fix out this issue or not. So type in net user space administrator space slash active double dot yes and then hit the enter key. This will go ahead and activate the hidden administrator account. Now close it. Go ahead, turn off your PC and then restart it and log in using your administrator account. If you are able to log in, you can easily copy your data from the account which is giving you the logon.ui.exe system error by creating a new user account. If you need detailed video on this particular step, go ahead and comment below and I'll provide you further details. Now if this method failed to work out, let's proceed with the second step. Again choose the option troubleshoot and choose the option uninstall updates. If this particular error is occurred after updating your Windows PC, you need to select both the options one by one. First of all, uninstall the latest quality updates and secondly, uninstall latest feature updates. After uninstalling both the updates, again restart your PC to fix out logonui.exe system error. If this also failed, in third step, again open command prompt, type in sfc space slash scan now and then hit the enter key. Now wait for it to finish the verification and once the verification is completed, go ahead, restart your PC to fix out the logonui.exe system error. Now go ahead, close it and restart your PC to fix out the issue. However, if this must also fail to work out, go ahead and again reboot your system using the Windows USB drive. I'll go ahead and show you further steps. Select language and this time click on the option install now. I don't have a product key. Choose the type of windows you would like to install and hit the next button to continue. Accept the terms and conditions. Choose the option custom install. Now here at this point of time you do not click either on the format or the delete option. Make sure you do not choose any option. Simply select the drive and hit the next button to continue installing the windows in your PC. And you can see the message here it is showing. If the partition you have chosen contains files from a previous windows, then these files and folders will be moved to a folder named windows.old. So as soon as you install the windows, as soon as the installation of this windows is completed, all the data of your previous windows will be found right in C drive windows.org folder. So go ahead, after installing new windows, you can easily copy the data from windows.org folder to this particular newly installed windows to fix out the issue of logonui.exe system error. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.